Hi and welcome to this screencast, the first uh, in a series about using uh, Geo ODF. So this is just to give you an overview of the program. Uh, Geo ODF is a tool for creating organ definition files uh, for Grand Org. These files are actually plain text files uh, in a config type. Um, usually they have an INI extension, but in this case they have an organ extension. They consist of sections uh, within the brackets, uh, square brackets, and then you have pairs of keys with values. And these files are pretty complex uh, to create and edit, um, so usually lots of mistakes tend to creep in when editing them manually. So for that reason, I've created a program to do that for us instead. And that program you can find on GitHub, uh, GeoODF. You download the latest version of it and then you unpack it. And there is no real installation of this program yet. So you just run it in place. Uh, Like so, and then you have it. Uh, so in this uh, program, you have a layout of the organ to the left here in a tree, mm, which contains all the elements of the organ and how you decide to display um, the elements on the panels. And to the right side you have a panel that will change depending on what uh, what element uh, you have selected uh, in the tree. This will change um, according to that. So uh, in the organ tree, you have the first section of the organ is um, kind of the structural parts of an organ that you can create. And then you have the panels that are how you want to display um, these elements or uh, the built-in um, elements of Grand Org, if you so decide to use them. Mm. The usage of the program is pretty simple. You, you can um, edit the text fields or fill them with values, and you can change uh, the spin control values or, or the Boolean um, radio buttons to suit what you want to do. And when you're finished uh, with uh, an organ, you save it by writing out this uh, organ definition file. That's the way to save it. And it will end up in the location you have set uh, for that file and it will have the name uh, you have entered here. To save as another name, you simply change uh, the name here and it will change. Uh, be careful when um, selecting the location of the organ file. Um, it's best to keep it in one place and uh, to get all the relative paths uh, correct. So uh, avoid changing the location unnecessarily. New organ just creates a blank new organ. Uh, open file you use for editing an already existing organ file and write to save. And this is just to exit the program. You have a quite decent help uh, in Geo ODF that describes
the usage of the program and what um, the elements and objects are and what they mean. So I highly recommend that uh, you read that. So that is this. That is the content of this uh, screencast um, overview. So I'll see you in the next video. Um, and for now, thanks for watching. Bye.